Hey you guys, I'm over here at 1415H Santa Margarita and uh, the tenants have vacated and it's it's definitely not looking as good as when we gave it to them. Um, first thing I'm noticing right away is that um, there's, uh, I don't remember the flooring being this way. Uh, this is that older Pergo, it's in pretty rough shape. He's got you know, a bunch of these uh, uh, slats or whatever you call them, these uh, pieces, they're like uh, coming apart further. So I don't know if there was like a lot of commotion over here, but these are all coming apart. Um, I mean, you know, I'm, I'm guessing you don't want to replace the floor. Um, I mean, it definitely could use it. Uh, I definitely don't remember the floor coming apart like this so much. You know, you could, um, I'm sure you could like, for instance, on this slat right here, let's see, you could probably have a handyman with a mallet, a rubber mallet could probably close those seams back up. But, um, you know, you've got a lot of scuffing on the walls and stuff, and it's pretty heavily soiled in here. This thing that I fixed, this side here is loose again. I mean, it's stuck down, it's not lifting off like it was before, but that thing uh, probably needs to be addressed again. Uh, I was gonna try to make this quick. I don't know what the deal was with this, but this is like, looks like they cut this, or I don't know if, you know, it looks like they cut this and pulled this open for some reason. I don't know if you knew anything about that. Um, you know, the toilets look like they really were never cleaned. You know, the tub's got like all this soap scum in the, in the soap dish. Um, I've definitely seen worse. That got dinged right there. Probably need to have, oh, and right there too, that got dinged. So this should be, this shouldn't be up here. This should be where it can hit the baseboard and not go through the walls. So that needs a little bit of attention. Um, again, like you've got a little bit of damage here on, on this drywall. I don't know what happened here. There was some kind of like a punch or something. I don't know. Um, there's no light in here. It almost looks like there, I was gonna say, it almost looks like some kind of mold or something, but that almost looks, it's starting to look like a shoe print. So I'm not somebody threw a shoe. Uh, this blind here is pretty trashed. I think this blind was already in kind of rough shape, but it definitely wasn't like that. I don't know what the deal is with that. That's a box of ant baits is what it says. Um, they abandoned a little piece of like a, what do you call it? Um, you know, a love seat. Closet in here is empty. Again, you know, I mean, we could probably get somebody. That, there's there's damage right there too. I'm not sure what that was all about. I don't know if you guys had something go on in here that I didn't know about because obviously I don't manage the property. But you know, there's a I don't know what they did right here. There's a little ding right there in the wall. Um, like I said, paint's pretty rough, heavily soiled, dirty. They definitely weren't the best cleaners. You know, that toilet doesn't look like they cleaned it very well, very much. So to me, it looks like at minimum, it needs a deep cleaning and probably a paint job. Um, and maybe somebody to come over here with a mallet. I don't know how all these things came apart like this. I'm sure a bunch of those could probably be a flooring guy could probably use a mallet from both sides and bring all those back together. And, you know, you're still gonna have dings and stuff in here. I don't remember that ding there. Uh, but the floor is the floor is pretty rough. I mean, you know, aside from all those things coming apart, you've got you know a bunch of these uh, edges that are like lifting and peeling just because they're this flooring is very old and. You know, it's in pretty poor condition and it, and it was in pretty poor condition before they got it. So you've got a lot of scuffing and soiling on the walls though. 
Um, I mean, ideally, probably a little bit of drywall work and a fresh paint job throughout, and probably a new floor would be not a bad idea. Um, it's pretty rough. The floor's pretty rough. They mostly got everything out of here, except for that uh, love seat. This was that cabinet door we fixed. Yeah, they got all their stuff out of there. So it's mostly um, some holes in the walls that are, uh, I don't know why those happened. And then a lot of soiling on the walls on the paint. And then these floors just are not looking good at all. So we'll have to talk about how to move this place forward. Thanks.